What's good, Superstar? Back with another VV video. You got Superstar Joe. You got Superstar Fan in the building. How's it going, fam? Bam, 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 bam. You didn't see that coming because I've been practicing shoulders, feeling a little bit better, but still not 100%, but does not matter. Caught you with that reaction or that um, surprise actions, and you just didn't see it coming. So if you if you got hit upside the head and you're kind of dizzy, just shake it off. And we're going to go in here. If you're new here, do not forget, become a superstar. Smash the subscribe button down below. Hit the bell notification so you know whenever we post about your favorite project. If it is VV, you got a VV video today. You had the bell on. You're putting first in the comments. Maybe we're going to start doing some SUP for the first in the comments. You don't know what SUP is. We're going to get there in just a second. Superstar VIP, $2.99 a month. Hit the join button underneath the video. You get stars next to your name, access to our drop spreadsheets, price prediction spreadsheets, first dibs on merch. That link in the description. Also, star in the universe at the end of every single month. And also, also, also free entry into the SUP, Superstar Utility Program. Bam. This is where you can follow us, Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. Also, we have a Discord down below where you're going to have to submit some things to receive some things. What are you talking about, Joe? Superstar Utility Program. Earn stars. We're going to have a live draw every single month. Accumulate stars for more chances to win win prizes there's a bunch of prizes that are available here how to earn vip member i just mentioned it hit the join button two stars entered into the raffle if you mint a crypto we have a link for cryptoids we are cryptoids ambassadors if you mint a crypto let us know on the discord in the superstar utility program tab and we will give you an extra star also if you max mint you will get seven stars max minting means you buy five cryptoids with our link you will get seven stars instead of just one per thing so it's max minting a little bit more efficient in terms of earning stars which is raffle tickets um also we have hats that's in the description buy a hat three stars more to come it's crazy we just keep adding and uh yeah it's gonna be it's gonna be a good time we're excited to roll this out this month um actually the end of the month is my birthday so it will be perfect timing to do the first raffle prizes guaranteed prizes right now for july are superstar money hat superstar money shirt Cryptoys has donated us five cubes for this uh, for this superstar utility program. So I mean, we're gonna have five Cryptoys cubes to give away, which they will transfer to you uh, to your account directly. So we do not have to do that. They will do it for us, and uh, it's it's a great great uh, partnership that we have over there, um, being ambassadors. So really really excited to be doing that. Additional prizes if we do receive a ton of, resp of of support. I mean, we've always wanted to give back whatever we are able to earn on this channel. Um, be it VIP membership, be it um, with the cryptoids, uh, kickbacks, any of that stuff. We want to make sure that you guys feel some of that as well. So that's why we're doing this. And I mean, if we see a lot of support, there's going to be a lot more added to this list here. Uh, this is just like, no matter what happens, if one person does it, they're going to win all the prizes. Like that is how it will go. Obviously, there's a bunch of VIPs already entered though. So um, it's, it's going to be a fun time. But uh, guys, that is the little rundown i know that not everybody was able to see it the first time that we did it we will continue to remind you until the end of the month so the intro has just gotten that much better let us jump into the vv twitter the door we talked about this yesterday it was a live stream it was a quick one but uh i want to talk about it a little bit more just because now i'm a little bit more focused we're not outside got my hat on fade showing so really really happy i did um miss the door wait list i forgot about it uh but i did end up jumping in and buying a bunch of doors I converted two doors for Miguel's. I had to go buy a Miguel to do this. I, <laughs> it's because I thought Miguel would be the very, one of the most scarce posters in the app, and then I just wanted to flip it. But um, right now I'm sitting on them because it's not being realized. I am i don't think that the numbers are public yet. Maybe when those numbers are updated and people are like, yo, there's only like 100 of these or whatever it is, I think people might be a little bit more in, inclined to have a look. But whatever. It was a It was a... A pull on the VV slot machine and it did not play out. I also got the Woody. I got two Woodies because I figured Woody might be the most sought after poster if anybody wants a poster. Uh, but the price predictions we had were way too high uh, compared to what this is. I thought that the scarcity would matter, but posters are proving to be what we thought they were. And I know it is my Achilles heel. I hate posters and I should not be able to flip off of posters. Leave me alone. It is what it is. It's in the past. I got my posters now that I will find a way to get rid of somehow. I don't know how. Maybe maybe they will allow me to burn the posters. That will be the best. We'll do a burn stream. I'll burn the posters. What do you guys think? <laughs> Kung Fu Panda. All right. We got uh, we, we heard, learned about this. There's a little bit more details now about Poe. We're getting his uncommon. 3,888 editions, 40 gems. That's way too much. Way too many for Poe. He's not uh, as 
big of a character as um, these, this mint size is, is asking for. Not everybody on Vivi is going to be buying one of these. Uh, there will be leftovers. That's my prediction. 40 gems, still expensive. Uh, I think I think that they missed the mark on that. But, I mean, it doesn't matter. You can leave it in the store. If there are new users who come, you can have a nice collectible available for them. So I'm not too too worried about the size of the of the additions. I mean, it, it affects the secondary market. That's one thing that really kind of bothers me. But um, they've been burning stuff. So let's see. Let's see how it goes. So um, it's cool to see some more DreamWorks, though. I mentioned that yesterday. Collector Spotlight, you got... Claritza. So, I mean, if you have not been following on Twitter, amazing, amazing AR photos all the time. Uh, I know Hulk is in them. I know that she's done a bunch with a bunch of different um, cosplays as well. So shout out to her. I mean, very, very pro Vivi, very, very um, good, good piece of the, of the community. And it's bringing the fun. And I mean, I always enjoy whenever, whenever they put out pictures and uh, AR photos, you know how we, we get about that. We really enjoy the creativeness of the VV fam. So that's one thing that we always we always shout out on our channel whenever we do see something that we like. Um, get a closer look. So this was the drop today. Big, big drop today. Hawk number one, you're here because of the title of the video. Waitlist was open. I applied for the waitlist this time. I did not miss on this one. I did not forget, but I did miss. I did not get in. So 10,000 additions and I didn't get in. That means that more than 10,000 accounts went for this. I don't know. I'm not 100% sure. Maybe. I guess people came back. They heard about the Hulk number one. Um, and uh, I don't know. But maybe they just are not fully participating in the secondary market with that much demand. I'm not sure. But, I mean, it is sitting around, I think, 50 gems for the common. And uh, Secret Rare was maybe around 1,300. So it's it's doing fairly well. If you went for it, you made some some gems. I think uh, even the uncommon, I think, was in 30s. So it was a must-go for a drop. If you did land it, congratulations on landing it. I did a couple things. And I'll let you know uh, in a bit. This is another thing about that. So then there's this other comic coming out right now. It is first appearance of Talos and Tamid, the marriage of Rick Jones and Marlo Chandler. Incredible Hulk number 418. Um, this is a very different version of the Hulk in the front here. If it is the Hulk, I'm not even sure, but he's got the slick back hair. You look like you got She-Hulk in the back. Um, this cover is pretty sick. The, the ultra rare and the and the rare even I really like. So. That's cool. Um, are you guys going for this drop? I don't know too much about it. I did not do research before this video. So we're going to leave it to the Lambies of the world and whoever else wants to leave a comment and uh, share with the fam. All right. So over to our Twitter. Um, we did do a price prediction of the door. Uh, that was a while ago, but uh, we announced the Superstar Utility Program. Big, big news. Uh, we talked about some some juju. Wampum has landed legendary number seven on palm so i mean i think this was going for like 4500 bucks if i'm not mistaken that's some crazy juju so congrats to you i mean i can't believe that uh speaking of juju we got rewind we've heard his name in the juju before landing grail luke skywalker on the cryptoids platform using the link with the superstar utility program are you kidding me right now you got stars entered you're getting grails you're getting juju everywhere it's just a fun time to be part of uh it. and i mean if you're going to be minting cryptoids anyways might as well use the link might as well get some utility with it get some extra for doing it you get the stars you're entered in a raffle you can win some stuff but if you also max mint you're going to get even more entries it's just why not do it if you're going to do that so if you are planning to mint some cryptoids definitely use the link um keep comp stack on he's having some issues listing some things um i don't know he's getting a little bit disappointed so we retweeted this hopefully vv is able to sort him i know that he was at the decon kickoff party he did not receive a vv logo he has sent a um a ticket i'm not sure if this has been corrected yet this was uh yesterday but he sent a ticket into vv and he sent a video of him at the decon with david you and dan Carlos. what other proof do you need you're gonna have to give him a v logo uh, I mean, you've been adding to the supply. Trust me, I've seen that. I mean, I'm not going to say anything. We, at this point, a lot of things are expected when it comes to um, mints and 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 whatnot. Uh, I know that they say some things. Sometimes things change. If people are owed the drop and they miscalculated, they miscounted, it's on them. Should they give something to the people who have already held, thinking that the size was different? Maybe uh, that might be a good way to do it. Someone else was saying maybe you just buy from the market floor burn them off, and then bring it back down to that uh, existing size. I think that's a great idea. I think they should do that. But uh, will they do that? We are yet to see. So let's see what they do. And let's see if Keep Calm and Stack On, Superstar, Legend, Hall of Famer, gets his VV logo. Will, I mean, incredible, puts out this uh, this tweet 
saying they finalized their latest partnership deal. I was actually just on a Spaces speaking to him. Uh, it was it was fantastic. Spaces, shout out Jay Clemente for running that. But uh, he was mentioning how this deal was signed on Friday. So they are now in, entering into the pre-marketing phase where they're going to discuss the marketing and how they're going to do this. But this will not be their next drop. He also clarified that this is going to be a drop down the line. They have a drop coming or a scheduled very big iconic partner uh, or iconic license and brand. Uh, he did not mention what it is. There was so much alpha. Anytime he speaks, you got to listen. He's he's always dropping little Easter eggs. And uh, I'm very curious to see what is next for them. Uh, anyone else getting a redemption error for a boo door? So this is something that happened. I had the door. I was trying to convert it to the poster. But because I had Miguel listed, it would not let me do the redemption. So that was something that happened. Uh, <clears throat> but then look at this juju. This is some ridiculous. This is some crazy juju. I don't know if I've ever seen juju like this. Shout out to Sunday Bucket. All right. Number 707. He was able to pick up on the floor. His birthday is on July 7th. And the drop was on July 7th. So, I mean, this door is not going anywhere. If you want 707, it's off. It's off the case. You are not getting it. But shout out to Sunday Buckets for being, being able to land a floored birthday slash drop day mint. Uh, i never seen anything like that. That's crazy. Cryptoids, they keep they keep talking about this UFO stuff. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what they are planning. But I keep seeing it. And I keep retweeting it. And if you're looking to hear more about the Cryptoids project, we got our boy DB Crypto, new ambassador for cryptoids as well uh, and he is doing a spaces on july 14th not with will this time but with freddie and with fonz two of the other co-founders so definitely go check that out july 14th next friday um then we got some more juju here booze activated door 1985 was able to get through so shout out to big j uh, and here is that video keep calm stack on proving that he was at the decon kickoff party uh i mean this was great memory so shout out to him hopefully everything gets sorted for you D one and only jumped in to cryptoids. He used the link, got the juju. She got the Juno. Um, I can't believe it. She got the third. She got the Grail on this one. Was this the Grail one? Uh, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, look at that. And she's got the the Galaxy version, and it's like one of them that I think it sparkles when it's out. Um, another fun thing coming to cryptoids is you got Buck Jester showing off how there's probably going to be some accessories. We know that's coming, so just doing some fun stuff with some cats wearing some clothes. Uh, if you don't know, Comet uh, is a cat in the Cryptoids verse, and I cannot wait to dress him up. We do have one of those. Uh, and then uh, another one, like uh, DB Crypto just keeps putting out the threads. If you want to learn more about Cryptoids, definitely go check them out. Alex and Crypto, I don't know how you did these, but he's making VV wish list. He's saying what he wants, and this time he did the Ninja Turtles. Check out these Ninja Turtles. They look incredible. Um, if you're able to do this, I think that VV should hire you because the quality looks amazing. Uh, and I think that the IP holders would love that as well. Um, and we had a happy birthday purchase. Again, Sunday Buckets, we just talked about him. He, he said, you know what? I'm going to buy number 101 gold Lambo. So congrats to you. And our buddy Jim Bully Lingo made me this sign right here. Um, he is at a UFC fight, and he brought his secret rare Miles Morales. Love seeing those things in AR like we mentioned earlier. Our link is always at the top. This space was amazing, um, and we're going to keep it going. So Let's look at the Hulk. This drop, just check out the prices pretty quickly here. Um, the common, 54, so it's going up a little bit. The uncommon, 30, so you're still in profits. The rare, 66, so more than the common. That's interesting. Um, 203 for the ultra rare, and the seeker rare is 13.95. So did, did well. If you landed this, you are in the profits. I did not land it on the drop. However, at the 15-minute mark, I was... Clicking my screen like this. I don't even know where I clicked. I have no idea. I didn't even see the button, but it popped up that I had the chance to buy it. Hit the buy button. Spun around for a really long time. I saw VV Vault actually. Same thing. It spun around for him, but he did not land it, but I landed it. I got the number. Uh, I got like a 1200 mint ultra rare. Floored that. Got 200 bucks. Used the 200 bucks. Bought a common low mint. Uh, and uh, here we are. I think I paid 100. So I like ended up profiting around 80 gems at the end of it because of the fees and all that stuff so maybe a little bit less than that but uh overall good drop i have a i have a low mid common which i like to collect and uh i've been eyeing the secret rare we'll see what happens but not too uh not too much in a rush for that um what are you guys doing did you guys land i want to hear in the comments how did you guys do on the hulk drop 
another thing I want to talk about, and this is something that um, I was I was shocked to hear because the thing worked for me. I mean, I worked for me on the on the rebound. I got the red bar for the initial drop, but it looks like this was not um, the perfect drop. And I know that they were testing the wait list and they were testing it with a lot of comics that not many people wanted to go for. Uh, so I guess you're going to have to at some point go for a drop or use the mechanic in a drop that will be much sought after. Uh, and Queen Vivi is showing some disappointment here. Uh, shout out to Laurie Brenner, great friend of the channel. I hope it comes through, but I don't think it will. And uh, this is this is the difference. So I noticed the difference between this one and the one I got was it says your order has been received, but it doesn't have a mint number. So like mine, when I got it, it said your order has been received. You got mint number, blah, blah, blah. Uh, for comics, you don't know your rarity, but it tells you the mint number. Because she did not get the mint number, it was not delivered. Now, when I got mine on the rebound, I had pending for over an hour. I don't know if, like, I thought maybe I wouldn't have got uh, the job just because it was so long and I was seeing a lot of this. I was seeing a lot of people getting the error saying uh, that they didn't get it or whatever, like order received, but then the gems didn't come out. Uh, a lot of a lot of this type of stuff happening on today's drop, and you probably think that I'm going to bash Vivi about it, but I'm not. I think that this is something that that it worked for them. The last couple of drops, obviously, they didn't sell out. Um, this one, it just shows that the loading is something that they are not able to handle, I guess, or or, or whatnot. It just like the background coding did not work out, and the only way I feel like to test this is to actually put it into process. Um, so, I mean, it's, it's unfortunate that this is, this did happen for some people, but they did get all 10,000 editions out and they did, um, they did, I don't know, I ended up getting a rebound. I mean, the, the rebound still went out. Um, and I noticed that a lot, like, I think VV feed had a post that said that only 4% look like they might be nefarious or botting accounts might not even be botting accounts. I'm sure that it's just like a, a, a guesstimate. But four uh, percent's a low number if that is accurate. Uh, so I mean, it's 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 like when you book a flight and then <laughs> and then you get to the airport and they're like, well, you know, we kind of booked too many seats. I mean, those planes, those airplanes are still going every day. They're making big money, those companies, and uh, and they make those those types of mistakes as well. So um, I think we got to give VV the pass. I did land one, so I'm biased. If I if it did happen to me, I would probably be pretty upset uh, and probably talk about it for like a year and a half. Uh, afterwards no I, I mean uh, that's just that's just the airdrop stuff you know it's uh i'm just joking around here but i do think that uh oh, if this is your first try like your first error with this i think now if it happens again then there might be something bigger happening in the background and maybe the the there's not proper testing or proper uh i guess quality assurance qa happening um, but I mean, you just had a perfect sample test. Now figure out what happened, fix it and be done with it. The other cool, cool error that, that I found yesterday I was talking about was on the door. It said serum. It said, ser it's like convert your serum. Serum was meant for the potion drop. I mean, it's something that like these types of details, and I'm hoping that this is not the case with this drop, that things were just ignored or missed or not QA properly. Uh, but it could be because that whole process and it was up for a long time I even tweeted it to them like guys maybe you want to change the wording to the door if it's something like that you can do simple but i don't know it said on the on the web app it's like oh you can do the serum on the phone it said go convert it the serum on the computer and it's telling you to go to a web app but why does it say serum why doesn't it say door it should say open the door on that like that that to me seems like such a simple thing that was missed um and i'm hoping that this is not something that that continues so what do you guys think do you think that uh that this error just maybe it's just because there's so much happening and they weren't able to test it like maybe you can't test this unless it's a real world situation i feel like you can though i feel like they gotta have like botting programs that can run the test similar amounts and and they probably did it uh who knows what's happening here but uh i was just disappointed to see this happen to a friend and, uh, and I noticed that it was happening where people were getting the, the buy now button and then they couldn't buy it. Very, very glitchy drop. Um, and it's unfortunate that it happened for such a high tier drop. I mean, there's not too many of these books left of this type of value. I know you got Captain America 1. Who knows if we'll ever see that because of the cover art. Um, but I think uh, I think they still got all 10K out. So we got to look at it that way. And right now, 
to me, the prices are attainable if you do want to have such a grail of a book. Um, it's nothing too crazy yet, and uh, considering the real world value, what do you guys think? Are you buying the Hulk number one? Are you buying Hulks? Are you anticipating that maybe they're going to come out with the fourth Hulk, which is going to blow the doors off of everything so that you can get that fifth Hulk? Is it going to be a 1,111 editions? What is the plan? You guys let me know in the description down below, please, uh, or in the comments, actually. Um, also, if you're planning to, to buy any cryptoids, don't forget to use our link and get some stars, superstar utility program. But don't forget also, become a superstar. Smash the subscribe button down below. Hit the bell notification. If you want to see some more VV content, I need to know what you want to see. I know people are letting me know. I want to see more VV. I want to see more VV. Here's a VV content. Let's talk about it. Let me know what you guys think also. VIP, $2.99 a month. You're going to get some stars. Enter into a raffle. You're going to ask access to stars in the universe. Guys, we're bringing the utility. It's going to keep on coming. And now anybody, it's open to anybody. You want a hat, link's in the description. Definitely go check it out. You'll get some stars for that as well. Guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. I love you. Bye.